I can hear you. I can see you. There she is, y'all. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Pasha. I'm good. How are you? Where are you? Um, I'm in LA. You're in LA. Okay. Staying, staying safe. That's good. That's good. All right. Well, really happy to uh, be able to uh, chat with you for two seconds. Yeah. Video came out yesterday. You look crazy. You look dope. It was. Oh, thank you. I hope everybody loves the video. I should have this crazy idea for this house party, so made it happen. Yo, by the way, I want to make it clear. Before um, this whole thing happened with the team, we <laughs> shot this video. Right. Just so everybody's clear. We, we're not we're not as, just at home, you know, just partying. I mean, oh, we are partying, but the video concept was uh, really intended to just be friends and family and, you know, the closest one to me. And um, you know, I just wanted people to just to get a sense of where the where the record goes and, and how to how it feels. And it is family. You got a little bit of aesthetic. This is how you know it is when we throwing throwing parties in L.A. or Atlanta or London, wherever we at. You know. Mm -hmm. I think I think we did a great job, uh, like showing that. Yeah. All of all of what I've seen, like feedback, the feedback has been great. So that's great. Um, but all of what I've seen is like everyone, especially because we're inside right now, everyone's like, oh, this just makes me want to, you know, feel good and have a good time. So I know once it, all of this is over, everyone's going to be using this as a, a reference to go have some fun. Well, hopefully it can be used as a reference right now. Put the record on and do what we did. You know what well, I'm yeah, saying? Well, yeah, yeah, of course. I but can't promise synchronize swimmers and stuff. But... <laughs> it's, limited, it's a limited amount of people that are allowed at your party right now, but. Yeah. I mean, you can have a house party with your family. You know what I'm saying? Maybe not friends and family over. Or you yourself. Keep... Put, put, the right. on, put the video on and have a party with yourself. Right. So a lot of people also, too, um, they, they wanted to know. I don't know. Maybe maybe we can scroll down and read, read some of the questions. Yeah, okay. Just read in. Yeah. <laughs> some comments. That's good. This video is definitely cheering me up. That's Joanne. Hey, Joanne. Mm -hmm. uh, it said, V loves us. She said, love the vibes. Haven't stopped watching the video yet. Yeah. You guys should go on tour together. Okay, Glover2 underscore nice. That ain't bad. Oh, <laughs> but first, we got to perform the song together. You know? I know. I can't wait. That's something that I'm super excited about, too. Because for anyone who is born in my generation, especially, I feel like to share the stage with you is <clears throat> crazy. So... I would love to be on stage with you. The same goes. I'm a huge fan, which is part of the reason that it all came together the way it did. I'm a fan of your music. I've told you that and a fan of you. But I really felt like um, you were perfect for the song. Like We put it together in Atlanta. Uh, Vito, uh, Beacox, and Hey, JD. Vito. I think Vito's in there as well. I saw him, I think. Hey, Vito. What up, Vito? But, um, you know, the song was pretty much... It was pretty much in the can. I was like, nah, man, I, I just feel like we got to have a female, and I need, like, the perfect voice and the perfect person for it. And I kept, you know, mentioning you. And uh, then B. Cox came to the studio, and he was like, oh, I'll just call her. So I was like, <laughs> all right. <laughs> and the rest became I remember history. You guys, when, when you guys called me, I remember I was on tour. I was in London, and it was, like, super random. And I'm like, how comes Brian's calling me? I got worried, like, I, like something happened. And then I pick up the I pick up the FaceTime and I'm literally like I think I was like in my pajamas like it crazy and Jermaine Dupri Usher and Brian Michael Cox are FaceTiming me and I'm like uh um I no wasn't pressure. prepared for this I was not prepared for this <laughs> but yeah no I'm so glad we actually got to like the timeline worked out as well and we got to actually be in the studio with it because I would have been so sad if I still would have loved to be on the song regardless but like I would have been so sad if we didn't get to actually be in the studio and do it together. Oh yeah. By the way, in any on almost all of the um duets that I've done have been done separately, you know? Never really? quite in none of them. And Wait, um Don't tell me that you and Alicia Keys were not in the studio together. We were not <gasps> in the studio together. Nope. Nope. My whole childhood is a lie. <laughs> <laughs> well Oh my sorry. god. But no, nah, it, it uh, it, it's it's crazy, <laughs> and I th I think I told you that's like it's great that we got a chance to at least you know check in. You yeah. basically finished the record by the time I got there because right. they I came in, they were like she's in there, and I was so like 
scared to walk in the room because I didn't know what your process was if you wanted to do it without anybody in the room. So I waited outside for like maybe 20 minutes because you knocked it out so fast. But um, I was outside. Did you really? For... I remember I, I, I literally, I wasn't, I closed my eyes and I'm recording. So I wasn't, I didn't see it. I didn't see you straight away, but I remember opening my eyes and I was like, okay, okay, wait, no, I have to do this. Perfect. Because he's in the room. Yeah. So I, I, I tried to stand in the corner for a little bit. And then finally <laughs> I, I walked over to the console it was like, yo, are y'all almost finished? She was like, they were like, nah, she's done. And you asked me if there's anything else that I felt like um, I should, we should, we should uh, put together. Because those type of harmonies, right, it's better when you do it together, at least together, consult yeah. with each other and, and, like, make it perfect. Yeah. But we put the final touches on and that was it, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I love the song, though. Like, love, love, love. I can't wait to perform it live with you. I think it's going to be amazing, man. It's going to be fun. It's definitely going to be fun. No hints of when, but, you know, there's a couple shows coming up, you know, once this whole thing is is uh, is back to normal. You know, I, I think that, you know, obviously right now um, we've been told to keep social distance and it really feels like things are not going to get better, but they are. Uh, we just have to realize we're together, stay home, you know, and, and really be safe. And when it's all done, we're going to do a big party somewhere. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to put you on the spot right now. So hopefully you'll be available if you're not already I'm doing there. the same thing on your side. Oh, yeah. No, of, of course. Of course. I mean, I wasn't planning on throwing a party myself. I don't throw parties, but I'll happily attend your party. Yeah, man. <laughs> and then afterwards, yo, we went to a concert or something like that. And do you yeah, remember? We went, yeah, we went to Lizzo's show. Yeah, we went to Lizzo's show and hung out a little bit. I was trying to get her to have a drink. She was like, no. I don't drink. <laughs> no, uh, I was driving. You have to be responsible. I you're right. You didn't, you didn't drive, so you were able to do that. I, was, <laughs> I had to drive home, so I was like, let me be responsible and not drink. But it was fun. We had we had a great time. And then even the, the video, I feel like it was just great vibes. Everyone was super fun. It was a nice day out. I mean, it started raining a little bit, but we yeah. had pretty much done outside. The yeah, outside wasn't it crazy of, how, like, as the night began to take over right mm -hmm. as a as the sun began to set then it started raining but all day was clear had a great time we were actually able to take our time beautiful home mm -hmm. you know there's one time for the synchronized swimmers there they actually put the like icing on the cake yeah we had family friends came through you know uh, e uh eric bellinger came through mm -hmm. uh Kristen king he came through justin came through all the family you know just came through the show love and then snoop I, I didn't even see Snoop. I didn't even know he was there. I, once, I, once I saw the video, I was like, oh, I didn't know Snoop was there. Oh, you didn't smell the aroma when you walked in? <laughs> that was the giveaway, right? <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't. I mean, yeah, you would think so. But, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nah, but, but uh, it was a perfectly catered party, uh, Vito. And Snoop, he can cook. I mean, it was, it was interesting. The seasoning. What, what, were you guys, <laughs> what were you guys seasoning in the kitchen? Nah, the whole vision was just to kind of, you know, be hood adjacent. You know what I'm saying? It's like no matter where you are, we still bring it. We bring it all the way back, you know what mm -hmm. I mean, to how we did things. And it doesn't matter if you, you know, you're a millionaire or a gazillionaire. It's like you still want to have that fun and that, that the way we do things is still the same. But doing it executively and, you know, and, and bringing, it, bringing the best out for my friends and family. So we had synchronized swimmers in the pool. The food was actually edible. Um, it was like gold leaf hot. Uh, you ate leaf. the donut, remember? Yeah. Hot donuts, gold leaf <laughs> hot donuts, and um, caviar, and it was it was great, man. Sprinkled with some gold sprinkles. Yeah, gold sprinkled donuts and caviar and lobster and all kind of cool cool catering. Let's see what sports center is in here. I was just saying hi to you. What's up, y'all? Um, let's see. Do a TikTok don't waste my time challenge video. Okay, I'm I'm with it. Do you have TikTok? I'm a tic, t uh, I can't speak TikTok. TikTok. I don't have a TikTok. Okay. Do you have a TikTok? I got a, uh -huh, I got a, I got a TikTok. Mm. Let me see. We want another collaboration. Well. Ella? Oh, sure. 
as I as I told you, you know, certain relationships are meant and intended to last for forever. You know, when I think about Roberta Flack and um, Dunny Hathaway, or I think about uh, Puffs and Mary J. Blige's relationship. You know what I mean? Like it's more. And I was telling her this on the set. I was like, yo, it's really more than just a song. Like I really appreciate you as an artist and want to continue to support and grow with you. You know, I like friends and family because you're gonna have ups and downs, but the ones that matter. Always the people that are there with you, and your heart is your heart is in your your greatest times. So just to celebrate you and continue to support you and what you do with your music, you got me. You can count on me. Thank you, I appreciate you, and I don't think you need me, but <laughs> I'm here. We need each other. That's 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 how it works. You know what I'm saying? From one one spectrum to the other. Yeah.